thank you so much for clicking on this video and for this video we're going to discuss managing two-factor authentication on NetSuite. Two-factor authentication or 2FA enforces a second level of security for logging in to the NetSuite user interface. You do not have to enable or purchase a feature to use 2FA in, in your NetSuite account. So setup is required for administrators are limited. So feel free to use it for all the roles that you would like to enforce 2FA. Please note that 2FA is required for administrator roles and other roles with highly privileged permissions. Also, starting March 1, 2023, Users setting up or resetting their 2FA configurations must install and use an authenticator app to generate verification codes. Starting March 1st, 2023, receiving of codes by SMS or message will no longer be supported for users setting up 2FA for the first time or for existing users who reset their 2FA. So all 2FAs will be done or will be all, all 2FA codes will be coming from authenticator apps. So let me show you how you can configure roles to have 2FA. So on your NetSuite account, just navigate to Setup, User of Roles, and Two-Factor Authentication Roles. You will be able to see all of the roles that you have. If you want to see the roles that are inactive as well, you can just check Show Inactives. And Again, these are all of the rows that you have. So let's say, for example, I want my employee center uh, row to have 2FA permission. So let me just look for employee center. So I have employee center. So right now, it's not required. So I'll make it as required. So everyone that's using the 2F, uh, that's using the employee center will need to set up um, their 2FA. And duration would be... Uh, I would say um, 25 days. So the maximum would be 30 days. Uh, this means that after 30 days, uh, when, when you log in, even if using the same um, device, it will prompt you to provide your 2FA or the code for your 2FA. So here I set it up as, as 25. So maximum is 25 and as often as Per session so every time you log in if you want your users to uh, provide the codes you can do that as well and after that you can just click on submit thank you so much for watching today's video if you have any questions please let us know in the comment section below and if you want to learn more about NetSuite, please subscribe to our YouTube channel or visit our website www.bspny.com. Thank you and have a nice day.